Hello Interweb, my name is Hanker and Games, and today we're doing uh, the first graphics card review of this channel. I'm so excited! So at the front of the box, we've got our um, little kind of directory that no one cares about. 2 gigs DDR5, uh, I wanted that. Um, that was a necessity for this card, I would have not gotten it. Uh, this is the low profile, low, yeah, low profile. This is the low profile space saving edition. Comes with two low profile brackets, not four, as it's seen on the box. If you look right under, it says different bundles, blah blah blah, different back packets, yeah, whatever. On the back, it kind of has um, another stuff that no one cares about. It's ready for 3D Mark, hybrid BIOS ready for Windows 8, solid capacitors, and MSI afterburner overclocking setup. So, opening the box here, which took me for such a long time. Oh yeah, guys, uh, like for more voiceovers. This is the first one. Whee! Uh, we open it up, and we get our um, weird cardboard packaging. I don't know why they couldn't have just used foam. Uh, I mean, it's, it's flimsy enough to where it provides good give. Low profile brackets, they're pretty cool. Uh, under this weird egg carton thing, we have our... Uh, quick user guide. It's really not specific to this card, but it's cool. Uh, driver setup. Haven't used it yet. Don't know if it's a pain in my rear or not. And then, uh, so here's the actual card. It's got a nice white circuit board. The, um, uh, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. So, the, uh, bag was difficult to open. Um, but it was nice plastic, uh, this is anti-static, uh, it meets the expectations for the plastic that my 980 came with, so I'm happy with that. Wasn't worried about anything when it came, so that's good. Alright, first impressions of the card. Uh, it was pretty good, uh, I was a little worried, it reminded me of the setup of the 610, I will be bringing a review on that soon, and I'll tell you why it worried me. Right, so the fan here is just under two inches. It, the fan itself was kind of beaten up. The sticker wasn't placed exactly, so that might be some whatever OCD right there. Uh, heat sink was just under three inches. We have our kind of weird little thingies that go over the um, PCIe and the display ports. Uh, so this, hmm. uh, the reason why it worried me if uh, was because see the heatsink is very small and the reason why it was small in the 610 is because the 610 has one gigabyte of DDR3 so it doesn't need that much but this packs a pretty heavy punch and I was I just got kind of worried but uh, I figured out after a little bit of research DDR5 RAM is cooler than DDR3 so yeah look at those uh, awesome camera skills so, uh, yeah, uh, the card actually from these first impressions of the Unbox were pretty good. I'm going to be giving a full review slash benchmark on it soon, so subscribe for that. Guys, like this video if you liked it. Add your favorites, tell your friends. Thank you for watching.